Hello and welcome back to Two Point Hospital. I am loving this game. <laughs> Theme Hospital is just so cool. Um, it's really chill except for when it isn't. The machine upgrade is complete. We got a few fire extinguishers dotted around to keep our precious machines safe. We got one in every room, I think. Uh, grateful for their continued support with psychiatry patients. Can access one of the machines, the extractor pan. Great for removal of unwanted kitchen utensils. <laughs> what? <laughs> Uh, Bernard Strew is ready for a promotion. Absolutely, you are repairing all our shit, so we'll slap a promotion on you, lad. Uh, constructing new buildings. We construct new hospitals by purchasing plots of land nearby. Take a look around the hospital grounds. I don't think we need it yet, but I'll bear that in mind. Uh... Alright, ooh. <laughs> we can build over this playground. We don't need a fucking playground. Um... Hands lab. By the sound of it, we're going to need you. In a room size, 4x4. Okay, it's possible to get a little tight, but. Okay, there's the extractor pan. <laughs> I haven't seen anyone with lightheadedness yet. But as soon as they pop out, then we'll. Uh... There's extinguishers everywhere, lady. There you go, lots of plants. Nature communes for sick people with more sense than money. Fortunately, uh, Chantel Hawk is ready for motion from student doctor to junior doctor. Current salary, new salary, 20 grand. That's very cheap for a doctor, so I absolutely promote. <laughs> You're happy. Clarabelle Hawk is pretty happy. You're nice and happy. You're right. You're right. Okay, staff are happy. What about the patients? Happiness, everyone seems, you know, fine. Bertie's, if Bertie Spoon does not have a spoon lodged in him, I'll be very upset. Oh, cool. Chuck Hunt. He just, could, just fucking take it off. Maintenance announcement. Plants need water. Okay, he's a bit busy. Uh, <laughs> Might get another one of them, actually. Seeing as we're possibly going to expand fairly soon. Likes to argue. Arguments to argue with other argumentative people. He's charming. He's a heartthrob. Look at him. That that guy's a heartthrob. Or her in the heartthrob. Oh, what is going on? Okay. Okay, so it's hovering over the plant that's doing it. Okay, that's like their radius of effect, I guess. GP's office. Is like, must be a wonderful place to work in. I think you don't think you really need to see the GP about that, lad. I think that one's pretty straightforward. Does it say wh who... Uh, staff doctor? Okay. Might have to get another doctor, because you're only a psychiatrist, so... Get another doctor to... to basically, uh, do everything else. Wow, you're awesome. I have you. Man, look at those... Ooh. <laughs> I've only got one psychiatrist, so... Pretty sure we... Yeah, I didn't see any of them that the were psychiatrists. Staff challenge from Isla Cups. It'd be great to work in a really spacious environment with lots of luxury furnishings. Something really prestigious. What do you think? Um, get a level 4 room. Okay. Current level... 3... 2... 3... There's one, like, really close to being... You're probably the closest. Let's get some more shit in you, shall we? Um, edit. Is there more we can get in there? Get some nice windows. Some light in. Uh, get another poster. Slap one on the wall there. What increases room prestige that we can buy? Hospital attractiveness. Decorative item. Uh, National poster. <laughs> Just slapping down fucking posters in hopes that it increases the room prestige. Uh, <laughs> what are you? You are no, I'm still miles away. Is it worth building another room? Well, we don't have enough doctors to staff another room, so. But you're fully energized, so. Although you're feeling a bit under the weather, I think. 
What's wrong, lady? Um, mood. You got no complaints. I think you're just a bit overworked. Have a snack. We'll be right back. <laughs> we now bring you this segment, Sir Nigel. Who's yeah? Who the fuck is Today announcing that? Why is your break multiple days? Establishment, les souffles tristes, and what a delight for the experienced palate this is. Oh yes. Scrambled emu eggs on pickled toast are particularly good. Oh, particularly good. Four salt shakers. Salt shakers. Okay, we got the guy's gonna have to wait 15 days before we can build ourselves a ward. Um, but that's fine. Oh, janitors. Yeah, need to get on that shit. Let's get some bins as well. Don't know if I've just made it so people can't walk past there, but. I guess we'll see. <laughs> How's patients boredom doing? They're still fairly bored. Might get a magazine rack down. There we go. Should keep them happy. Oh, sugar. I was hoping we wouldn't get any of you. Four days until we get our ward, and then we'll have to get the uh, Lux, Flux, Bucks, Tux thing. Okay, rooms, ward. That's a bad place to put it, I think. Uh, subtract from room, actually scratch that. Yep, let's try that again. Staff facilities are out of bounds for all patients and some staff. <laughs> I love that one. Let's put you there. Doctor to Pan's lab, please. Should do a locker prestige this room up a bit. Don't actually need the filing cabinet, it turns out, but oh well. We can put it in between the bed, we can. Nice light head poster there, and an anatomy poster on the other side. So you can tell it's a truly classy room. We need another nurse. Oh, you look good. Expensive, but good. Discussing a skin condition. Okay, it's so this pharmacy. Treatment in our pan's lab. Uh get a patient to wait. We need to build one of you. Deluxe clinic. Bin. Extinguisher. Plant a basic one in this one, I think. Cool. And um, we'll get a couple of benches and a drinks machine over there. Right. Oh, shit, I'm broke. Uh, <laughs> right, I guess we've just got to wait now for the money to hopefully roll in. Porter on the field, Sally Fig Blanket. Let's go a new Ernest Porter's head. Treatment in our ward, field. that's fine. As to what she was reporting on, I cannot say. Nobody tells me anything. <laughs> Nobody tells me anything. Who needs to staff this room? It's a doctor, yeah. Oh dear, that doesn't look good. Oh, you don't look good at all, lad. Is there no snack machine around here? Uh, let's put a snack machine somewhere if we can. There we go. Is that, is that guy buggered off or has he died? What are you guys looking like that for? You're hungry? Oh, you're hungry, that's why.
Okay. Okay. I didn't realize we didn't have a snack machine. On the go. But how are my patients happy? Oh, yeah. That must be why. Needs a toilet. Well, there is a toilet right... Fucking... Wait, did we not build a toilet? Oh, dear. We didn't build a... Oh, dear. That... Oh, dear. That's... That's why. Oh, dear. We're blowing it. Right, let's get some quality of life shit on, shall we? My staff are probably yeah, fucking pissing themselves as well. Okay. Get the hand dryer in there. A lovely plant somewhere. There we go. That'll do. Now everyone's gonna rush to the fucking toilet. And I think we might get another snack machine down as well. As people are bloody hungry. Is there anything we can get to luxury snacks? Is a bit bit beyond us. Uh, sweets dispenser. Reduces his hunger. Yeah, that was quite small, so that works as well. There we go. Report a visit. Uh, impressed a VIP with a nice hospital. A mysterious spells coming from Mary Dung. Okay, yeah. That, mm. <laughs> okay, people are less unhappy now, so. Seems rather ex excessive for a pan on the head. Uh, okay, we've got quite a few people on our ward, which is good. Okay, you're on cool. <laughs> oh, I like the use of the watch. That's that's classic. That's classic consultant move. Hey, and you're watering the plants as well. Right, where's this reporter then? Oh, here we go. I can't. I can't see them. Their stats. Uh, one of Jasmine Odyssey's background performers is unwell and looking for treatment. We are rewarded. But if we treat this VI patient, should we have them here? Yeah, sure. If it's just a visit to a pharmacy, that's fine. But we're probably going to need another GP's office. We've got a bit of cash now, so... Get another GP's office over here. It's a teeny one. Uh, bin. Oh, sweet dispenser. We got any doctors we can hire? You look quite good. That didn't sound good. Someone died. Someone died by the bloody reporters here. Yeah, not done. Oh dear. Oh hey, lady, can, can someone clean that up? The reporter's right there. Uh, okay, it's fine. She's just a ghost. That's fine then. She's investigating the staff room. You're heartbroken. Treatment failed. Okay, we couldn't convince him that he isn't Freddie Mercury, even though Freddie Mercury is literally dead. Okay, he's going to the general diagnosis. Cool. Where are my doctors at? Okay, one's in there. Is anyone waiting for that? No, you must be into the GP's office. Staff challenge to go 90 days without a death. Well, we can only try. Somehow, I doubt it. <laughs> I think we might need another doctor if we can. There we go. I know you don't have a job yet, but you will very soon. Oh, we've only got one psychiatrist. Oh dear. Too many people and not enough to do. Uh, I don't think you're a psychiatrist, are you? 
Also, you're very sure of yourself. Should really have a plan by now. Oh, he's a bloody consultant. If he hasn't got a plan in life yet, he's already a bit fucking late. Um... Where is the VIP? Okay. What have you got? Another point in, in the... Ugh. So let's bump you up. Okay, you've been called into this one? <laughs> so you were kind of wandering around a bit there. She's leaving. Cool. I don't know if he killed anyone again because we got a pop, pop, pop. Oh, I've lost where I am. <laughs> oh, there's another patch of land. Uh, okay. They just find uh, maybe it's only a neighbor. We get a nice big positive mention in it. It's good publicity, but I wonder if it could be better. Yeah, well, that's not bad. Sally Fig Blanket, Two Point Radio's roving reporter, has been investigating the state of our local hospitals today. I certainly hope she did not waste any time interviewing patients. I mean, what possible value would that have? Oh, yes, the damn patients. The problem with hospitals these days is the patients. Okay, we haven't... Oh, okay, there's a guy coming in with the old pot on his head. Might be able to get that challenge done finally. Oh, you got a staff challenge, have you? Failed to complete the. Okay. But it doesn't seem to affect anything. Maybe you're just upset with me or something, but. Alright, oh, are you going to the old uh, Pan's Lab? Good. I think you might be looking for a bin. Um, let's take a leaflet stand down as well. For the four patients in this area of the hospital. Like, okay, yeah, you're going to the GPs. Oh, he's in bed. <laughs> you're just laughing at the... Anatomy poster there. Oh, hello. Congratulations, the hospital has awarded the one star rating by the two point health ministry. Like lightning, you've made a mockery of your detractors by striking a second time. Uh, you are commended on your endeavours in the inner workings of machines and the human mind, respectively. Now focus on your budding two headed empire or add a third head by opening a new hospital in Flottering, as it's currently not much of an empire. Uh, let's continue on in this one a bit, I think. Cardiology and the Deluxo Lux 2. Which I think we can afford to upgrade. Yeah. Cardiology unlocked. Okay. If anyone needs cardiology, we will get right on that. Our receptionist is, seems to have buggered off. She must be on a break somewhere. She's quit. Uh, good news we've cured the VIP patient. A generous donation has been made to the hospital. Nice. Okay, there's a queue building up. Where is that receptionist? She's not in the staff room. There she is. She have a nice break. She's all right for three days. I hope you guys have got solid calves because you're going to be standing for three days. In general diagnosis. But I don't want to interrupt her break because she might get pissed off. Okay, there she goes. She's going by herself now. Oh, uh, there's a lot of happy people around now. A lot happier. We had a brief blip. Uh, oh, Pat Strong is not doing too well. But he's happy. Uh, Lazy Bones, he must be in bed somewhere. Where are you? Oh, there's Archibald Bog. He's perfectly happy. Uh, where where are you, my mate? Uh, oh, Pat Strong. Oh, okay, his health has shot back up. 
but if he itches a bit. Oh, once he lies down in bed, it'll be fine. I was in the any review. Is rent an eel. Okay. For all of your short term eel based needs. Okay, you're interrupting my award ceremony. This is two point radio. Okay, what are my awards? I am. Doctor of the Year is presented to Dr. Clarabel Hawk. Okay, and the next award is for Nurse of the Year, I assume. Is. Hester Shandy, Two Point Foundation. A lot of cash. A lot of money. Janitor of the Year. It's gotta be the upgrading guy. I can't remember his name. Oh. Oh shit. My janitor was the best damn janitor around, and you know it. Uh, it's. Uh, fucking bungle bastards. Employer of the Year. That's me to a T. That's my name. What's my name? It's. it's Lower bollocks. That's my name. Is lower bollocks. No deaths. Um, is awarded to no one. Most prestigious hospital is. Uh, is it the two points in lower bollocks? It's not. But the patient's choice, or oh, my patients love me, and they all say lower bollocks. Well, we did pretty well out of that. Four out of four out of eight, fifty percent of awards went to us. I'll go with that, and we will end it on that note. So thank you so much for watching. If you like my content, please do check out my other videos. And if you do, I shall see you there. Goodbye. <laughs>